In today's video, we're gonna be talking about the most common mistakes that lash artists make when they are doing mega volume. The number one most common mistake when lash artists are doing mega volume is not grabbing enough lashes in your tweezer. This is extremely important because mega volume, the whole point of mega volume is to get at least 20 lashes in a fan. 20D, 20 dimension is what you wanna have in your tweezer when you are applying a mega fan. Of course, every single fan does not need to be that big depending on the health of their natural lash. Treat every single lash individually. So if there's a lash that is unhealthy, you don't wanna put a 20D on there, maybe put a nine or an eight, but for most lashes that are healthy, you wanna get up to 20D. And a common mistake is not pulling enough off the strip and getting to that 20D so you can make that beautiful large fan and get them really dark and dense. That is a very common mistake that lash artists make. The number two common mistake that lash artists make when they are doing mega lashes is not pinning up the lashes so you can get that bottom layer of the lashes and creating a dark and dense look like a mega volume fill or full set. It's to look like if you pin back the lashes you're able to get that entire bottom layer it gives you a very full dark look and another trick is if you also do one length shorter on the bottom layer it allows you to get a more dark and dense look so try that next time when you're doing a mega set always pin up the lashes back get that bottom layer so they can get that really dark dense mega look the third most common mistake is getting glue or your adhesive on the tip of the lashes. This is very common. The mega volume lashes are 0.03 diameter. They're very thin, they're very light, they're very fluffy. And if you are moving around a lot with your fan, it's very easy to get glue on the tip of the lashes. And when you comb them out, you're gonna get stuck. Make sure you move lashes out of the way so you can make sure you apply it properly. You do not get glue on the tip. That is the third most common mistake that lash artists make when they are doing mega volume lashes. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope this brought a ton of value to you. If you are looking to take a lash class and be certified in lash extensions, please head over to the Live Bay Lash Class website and see if we'll be in a town near you. Question for you, what are some common mistakes that you have run into when you are doing mega volume fills or mega volume full sets? We'd love to hear it. Leave the answers in the comments below and we'll see you next time.